Yes, I know I'm not an ordained minister, but I have this deep passion for creating an environment where young Christian sisters can be themselves and share their burdens no matter what they are facing. The only thing bothering me now is that I've become so busy that my quiet time is suffering. I've become really inconsistent. What can I do? Wow, that's another relatable question. That being said, my question is about men. Mm. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> I know that's what you all want to hear. I'm going to make you an offer. Yeah? And it's either you accept it and live with me happily ever, or you reject and regret later. I think I have to go now. No, 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 no. Why will you go when we are hosting such an important guest? Ah, but I wouldn't be able to contribute to your elderly conversations. David will be there, you know. Oh, David. Ah, my bishop. My, my, my bishop. My big king. Ah, ah. It's been a <laughs> Good to see you. Good to see you. I've been here like uh, in just two years now, and this place looks very different. Very uh, beautiful. Well, yes, we just recently renovated wow. some part That's of the awesome. building. Some part of things building. continue to be better for us in Jesus. Amen. Madam. Yes, please, 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 please. How are you, madam? I'm very fine, sir. Please, please, please take yes, sir. Uh, I can see your hand on my brother. You've been taking good yeah. care of him. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for acknowledging that fact. Uh, uh, my bishop, you, 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 I believe you're, you're supposed to thank me too for <laughs> taking good care of her. Now you can see that she's looking so radiant. Okay. Okay. All right, all right, all right. <laughs> thank you. I can see your hand on her too. Thank you very much. Yeah. Okay. Where's my daughter? Um, she will. She's here. Momo. Momo, my daughter. Good afternoon, sir. How are you? <laughs> I'm fine. It's been a long time. Yes, sir. How are you doing? I'm doing well, sir. God bless you. Yes, sir. Your sermon in the church today was so powerful, sir. No, God be praised. God be praised. Good afternoon, Marenike. Good afternoon, brother David. I will just finish setting the table now, sir. Okay. Hmm. okay. Bye. My Dickin. Your daughter is very beautiful and hardworking. She, she's well brought up. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Mm. Thank she, you, sir. She, she's well brought up. Thank you, sir. Mm. Bishop, I have been observing and looking at uh, David. The older he gets, mm -hmm. the more of your confidence is building on daily basis. Yes, you can say that again. I, I just hope he does not inherit some of my rascality, you know, back then. I, <laughs> I understand. You know now. <laughs> so, David, when are you going back? Um, I, I don't have a date yet, Ma. I have issues with um, the particular projects I'm working on. But once I clear it up, I should return to the UK. He's very much with us now. He's very much around. <laughs> and that's good. So we see how you hold ourselves for now. Yes, well. He's very much around. <laughs> uh, my, my bishop, mm. by the way, your message, oh my God, was so resounding, mm. so powerful. Oh, bless God. Mm. Oh, bless God. <laughs> Jesus be praised. The table is set now, ah. sir. Okay. okay. More, more. Bishop, <laughs> shall we? Shall we? Food for the tummy! Yes, so Tommy for food! <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you very much yeah, for your that. hospitality. Yeah, welcome, Bishop. Mm -hmm.
This is so delicious. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thanks to Renike. Hmm? Wow. Renike, you cook this? Yes, sir. Jesus. This is she's a very great cook. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ever since um, my wife died, you know, that was like um, about 10 years now. I don't think I've ever eaten food as delicious as this. Mm. Well done. My, my, my bishop, uh, have you been coping over there? In the UK? Yes. Well, I have a chef and all, but then... Hmm. Nothing beats uncooked meal. <laughs> I think there must be an anointing for it. <laughs> Renika, thank you so much. The, the Lord bless you. Amen. Sir. The Lord bless you also. Amen. Amen. As you have nourished us, the Lord bring nutrition to your life. Amen. You know, physically, spiritually, financially, mentally, and maritally. Amen. God bless you. Amen. And then, so uh, maritally, Renika, how far? I've been expecting my brother to give me, you know, an invite to your wedding. You know, what's happening? <laughs> Sir, I I don't um all this generation X and um play now to get. Generation X? You yeah, know, millennials. Those born in the nineties and early two thousands. It means generation Y. Oh, I see. Whatever it is, X, Y, Z, or whatever you people call it these days, all the little mass we didn't we don't take much time when we want to Take those actions, you know. You are correct indeed, my bishop. <laughs> you are correct indeed. Yeah, so, my daughter, are you in a relationship with Jari? No, sir. I'm still very much single. <laughs> <laughs> From what I've seen, Renike, your husband is going to be a very fortunate man. He had better hurry. <laughs> <clears throat> um, I, I have something to say. Yeah. Mm. I think I need to pack the plates now. Don't worry. You can do that after we leave the dining room. Okay. Um, firstly, I want to sincerely appreciate the additions for hosting us today. Mm. Mm. Thank you very much. Mm. Yeah. You're welcome, my son. Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. Anytime we come to town, you go over and above to ensure that we are comfortable and mm. well fed. Mm. 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 We say very big thank you to you. Mm. We appreciate it. Thank mm. you. Um, <clears throat> on our way, my dad told me something, and uh, I know he would not mind me repeating it. <laughs> of course, of course. Dickens, up. Yeah. You and my father have been friends since Bible college days. Uh. It's been, it's been a while now. <laughs> <laughs> and um, since my mom died, your relationship mm. have quadrupled. Thank you very much, sir. Yeah, 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 we're cool. We're cool. So I thought to myself that um, how do we solidify this relationship, this bond even further? Okay. Mm -hmm. Then my um, Dad and I decided to gift you something. Thank you, David. Thank you, David. Oh. Thank you, my bishop. Yeah. You see, um, okay, yeah. Okay. My bishop. Yes, um, what uh, my friend, mm. it's Harry. Mm. This is um, a replica <laughs> of um, the broken pieces of tablets that God gave Moses. Wow. wow. Yeah, I got it from my last trip to Jerusalem. Wow. Yeah. I know of your interest in all the um, biblical artifacts. Yes, yes. You remember? Uh, of course. <laughs> of course. So, wow, my bishop. Thank you so much. Bless Thank God. you so much. Bless God. Wow. Thank, Thank you. you. David, the next one. Yes. Uh, this is for you, madam. You know, it's a prayer journal. Oh, of wow. course, from Jerusalem. 
Wow. Yeah. Wow. Oh, thank you so very much, sir. Oh, we are grateful to have you in our lives. Thank you. That's good. Thank Momo, you. you are not left out. Mm -hmm. And this box is a mesh, a, a bracelet, you know. It has an engineering insignia. Ooh. Wow. The moment I saw it, I know you will like it. Wow. Wow. <laughs> Thank you very much, sir. Oh. Thank you so very much, sir. So, when next are you coming to town? When next your pastor invites me? No, 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 I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Now that um, David is going to be in town, you should see me before the end of next year. Yes. My, my bishop, my wife has, was just actually asking because, you know, we would like to see you outside yes. uh, church invitation and all of that. And, uh, and I would love to, to, to see you guys more often too. I'll make more time now, you know, because um, uh, we have this commitment in our church in the UK. Okay. And mm. That has taken much of my attention. Oh, oh, oh. Thank you you could come over instead. Mm. I don't like the weather in that country. <laughs> the last time we visited, my hands froze like this. <laughs> that was because you refused to use your hand gloves like you <laughs> advised. You are right. You are right, my bishop. You are right. You are right. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much. Um, you, we, we have to go now. Um, my flight is um, first thing tomorrow morning. Mm -hmm. And um, I want to take some time to rest before I go. Don't worry. You'll be back before you know it. Oh, good. <laughs> mm. Let me bless you before we go. Thank oh. you, Bishop. Thank, Thank you so much. Right. Thank you, my Bishop. Thank you. Thank you. Eternal Father will bless you. You heard the man. There's no time Thank to you, waste. Yes, sir. Thank you so much. Yes. Thank you for coming. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Ah. All right, sir. Thank you. All right. God bless you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Living already? Oh, yes, mommy. I'm tired. And you know tomorrow is Monday. I see. I saw everything. What did you see? There's a saying that what an elder sees sitting down. A child cannot see it while standing. I still do not understand what you're saying, mommy. Bishop's son, David. What is between the two of you? There's nothing between us. <laughs> I saw the way he was looking at you. Mm. And I know that look. That is the kind of look that got me hooked to your father for 35 years and to marry for 30. Has it proposed to you? Okay, mommy. I think we need to talk now. I am her here's daughter. The father is in the room, resting. So it is just us girls. Sit down. <sighs> All right, so for a while now, David has been telling me that he's led towards me and that he wants me to be his life partner. Okay, so what's the problem? 
Don't you like him? It's not like I don't like him. I... What is it? I'm not just late towards him. Do you have someone else? Mommy, you know I'm single to stupor. I really want to get married soon. But I'm not just late towards David. I see. I find that a bit strange. For one, David, I am sure, is a dream man of many sisters. But my daughter is a different breed. He's godly, handsome, well-to-do, and a son of a big-time man of God. Or are you scared of becoming a mommy <laughs> I've not even thought about that. That doesn't bother me. Have you prayed about his request at least? <sighs> no. Have you given him any response? Um, I told him to give me some time. That's good. Do the needful and we'll continue from there. But don't push him away until you have your confirmation. Thank you, Mommy. Thank you. All right. All will be well. God will take control. And you will not make mistake in the name of Jesus. Amen. Mommy, I have to go now. Hmm. That's okay. All right. Smile. All right. Okay. God be with you, my daughter. Amen. All right. Bye-bye. You like her, don't you? Who? Morenike. <laughs> well, well, she's okay. <laughs> you can't fool me, son. I have your father. I, I saw the way you were staring at her. You were very quiet, but um, your longing was very loud. She won't give me a chance. I would pray about it if I were you. She's a real gem, you know. Someone I wouldn't hesitate to give my consent to. Pray about it. She's um, she's an asset. She's a she's a blessing. Dad, can you can you just? <laughs> I've heard. Just, just, just pray about it. Insane. All right. Insane. Good morning, brethren. Good morning, sir. I'd like to welcome you to today's Sunday school class. Uh, now, before we move on to what we have today, I could want to give us a brief recap of what we learned last week's Sunday School. Uh, we learned about the gift of the Spirit. And I remember I told you that there is difference between uh, the gift of the Spirit and the fruit of the Spirit. And it's so unfortunate that many people in our generation build their lives on the gift, neglecting the fruit. Not knowing that the bedrock of the gift is the fruit. And the topic for today is the wisdom of Solomon. Can somebody repeat after me? The wisdom of Solomon. One more time. The wisdom of Solomon. Good. And if you check through the Sunday School manual that is in your hands, you will see there that we try to define what this wisdom of Solomon was and is. Can, can somebody quickly open uh, the book of First Kings, chapter four, from verse twenty-nine to thirty-four? First Kings, chapter four. 29 to 34. And God gave Solomon wisdom. Hmm.
Sister Morenike? Sister Morenike? Yes, I do. Ah. Yes, you do what? Sorry, please. What was the question again? <laughs> <laughs> Are you right? <laughs> so serious. <laughs> <laughs> Wait now, you don't mean it. I'm telling you the truth. Huh? All of a sudden, she just shouted, Yes, I do. Jesus, for what? Yes, I do for what? <laughs> Good afternoon, Sister Monica. Sister Monica. Happy Sunday to you too. Happy, Happy Sunday. Sunday. Good afternoon. Oh, Sister Mo. Sister Mo. Bro, Michael. Are you okay? Of course I'm okay. What's the problem? I'm asking because I discovered that you were not your usual self during the Sunday school this class this morning. Oh, are you referring to the little episode that happened in the Sunday school class? Oh, yes. I'm all right now. It's nothing deep, I assure you. Sure? 100%. Please take good care of yourself and um, you have a wonderful week ahead. You too. I really appreciate you checking on me. Thank you. Oh, it's nothing. What are we bringing for? All right. Bye. <coughs> Jesus. You startled me. You know we were in the open, right? And so? Yes, I do. What was that about? You wouldn't understand. Try me. Don't worry about it. See, if I did not know you well enough, I would have said you were having a thing for Brother Michael. Michael? Bumi, please change the topic. But you are always acting funny whenever he's around. See, Bumi, please drop it. David's proposal is still weighing heavily on my mind. I don't know what to tell him. You want my honest advice? Tell him you have somebody else. Uh, but I don't have somebody else. Okay, fine. A daughter of Zion should not lie. Mm -hmm. Then tell him the plain truth if you don't like him. See, it's not the matter of whether I like him or not. Then what is it about? I feel restless whenever I try to picture us together. Ah, I see. The Holy Spirit is telling you what I am sure you already know about. Uh. Hmm. When this kind of restlessness comes upon a child of God, it usually implies a warning from God about the situation. However, don't let us jump into conclusion. What do I tell him? Ask him to keep waiting. What if he moves on? What are you scared of, my dear? My daughter, you are not yet at an age where you will be desperate. And that will not be your portion in the name of Jesus. Amen. Um, is that all you wanted to see me about? Actually, there is one more thing, Mommy. What is that? Thank you for watching today's episode of the Husband and Wife series. Are you ready to listen? Sure, I am. Can you assure me that nobody in the girls alone group will hear about this? Murenike, you're talking to me. I, Adebumi Lopez, will never snitch on you, and you know it. No, I will not allow you to do that. Congratulations. 
You don't look happy. I did not come here for felicitations. What's the problem? Yeah. 